Coming up on High School Quiz Show, it's Weston. <laughs> Taking on BC High. That's next on High School Quiz Show. Major funding for High School Quiz Show is provided by Safety Insurance. Boston traffic is the worst. Safety Insurance offers auto insurance policies designed to help for when the worst happens. You can ask an independent agent about safety insurance. Safety Insurance. We'll help you manage life's storms. Additional funding is provided by the Museum of Science, Massachusetts Teachers Association, Xfinity, UMass Amherst, Peabody Essex Museum, and Subaru of New England. Hi everybody and welcome to High School Quiz Show. I'm your host, Joe Hansen. Last week, Acton Boxborough defeated Littleton to move on to the quarterfinals. In today's match, we welcome Boston College High School and Weston High School. On the BC High team, we have Danny, Lucas, Theodore, and Jack with alternates Ambrogio and Riley, and Coach Walter Harris. <laughs> Competing for Weston, we have Finley, Lachlan, Gabriella, and Ben, with alternates Libby and Claire, and Coach Allison Langsdorf. The competition has four rounds. Toss up, head to head, category, and our lightning round. We start with the toss up round. Now all answers are worth 10 points. There are no point deductions for wrong answers and players you may confer. So teams, if you're ready, here we go. Let's have a great match. King Charles III commissioned 12 new pieces of music for his coronation, including an anthem by what composer of the musicals Cats and the Phantom of the Opera. Gabriella. Andrew Lloyd Webber. Correct. The 1988 book, My Life with the Chimpanzees, was written by what English anthropologist who was the first to study chimpanzees in their natural habitat? Finley. Jane Goodall. Correct. With 17 titles each, what team is tied with the Los Angeles Lakers for most NBA championships? Lucas. The Celtics. Boston Celtics is correct. Which of Newton's three laws of motion is also known as the law of inertia? Gabriella. Newton's first law. Correct. Okay, take a look at your screens. A prisoner of war in North Vietnam for five and a half years. What Navy officer seen here in 1973 went on to become a U.S. Senator from Arizona and the Republican nominee for president in 2008? Danny. Uh, John McCain. John McCain is correct. The Erie Canal is an artificial waterway that links Lake Erie and what New York River? Theodore. The Hudson. Hudson River is correct. In 2023, amid an increasingly bitter political and legal battle with Governor Ron DeSantis, what company canceled plans to build a new billion dollar corporate campus in Florida? Finley. Disney. Disney is right. In 2014, what 17 year old girl who famously stood up to the Taliban became the youngest recipient of the Nobel Peace Prize. Ben. Malala Yousafzai. Malala is correct. The Beer Hall Putsch was a failed attempt by Adolf Hitler and the Nazi party to overthrow the Weimar Republic. It took place in 1923 in what German city? Jack. Munich. Correct. Take a look at your screens now. We have a question from a very special guest. Hi, I'm Max Page, president of the Massachusetts Teachers Association. Here's my question. What author of the best-selling novel, The Da Vinci Code, once worked as a high school English teacher? Is it Ian Caldwell, Dan Brown, or John Grisham? Ben. Dan Brown. Dan Brown is correct. Common in many high school biology classrooms, members of the taxonomic genus Drosophila are better known by what two-word alliterative name? 
Finley. Fruit flies. Correct. Which of the following composers was born first? Igor Stravinsky, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart, or Johann Sebastian Bach? Finley. Bach. Bach is correct. Do or do not, there is no try. What Jedi Master famously says this to Luke Skywalker in The Empire Strikes Back? Ben. Yoda. Yoda is correct. For 71 days in 1973, members of the American Indian Movement occupied the hamlet of Wounded Knee, the site of the 1890 massacre of Sioux men, women, and children in what U.S. state? Danny. South Dakota. Correct. The 24th and final book of Homer's Iliad ends with the funeral of what Trojan hero killed by Achilles? Gabriella. Hector. Correct. In 2023, what former Boston mayor left his cabinet post as U.S. Labor Secretary to accept a job as head of the union for the National Hockey League players? Ben. Marty Walsh. Marty Walsh is correct. Featured in the James Bond film Moonraker, Sugarloaf Mountain is located on a peninsula overlooking the famous beaches of what Brazilian city? Lucas. Uh, Rio de Janeiro. Correct. Which of the following is a synonym for acumen? Discernment, zenith, or wealth? Finley. Discernment. Correct. What American inventor is the subject of the 2008 biography, The Wizard of Menlo Park? Danny. Edison. Thomas Edison is correct. In 1974, archaeologists discovered 8,000 statues of life-size warriors buried with the first emperor of China. The figures are made from what material that means baked earth? Finley. Terracotta. Terracotta is correct. In Euclidean geometry, what 11-letter word refers to a platonic solid with exactly four faces? Gabriella. Parallelogram. No. BC High, opportunity if you like. Lucas. Uh, rectangular prism. No, we're looking for tetrahedron. From 1957 to 1986, what Caribbean country was ruled by father-son dictators known as Papa Doc and Baby Doc Duvalier? Jack. Haiti. Haiti is correct. Alicia Silverstone stars in the 1995 film Clueless, a modern retelling of what Jane Austen novel about a young woman who meddles in matchmaking despite being unaware of her own romantic feelings? Gabriella. Emma. Emma is correct. In 2019, scientists found a fossil site in North Dakota that contains animals and plants killed and buried within an hour of the meteor impact that killed the dinosaurs. This happened approximately how many years ago? Six million, 66 million, or 600 million? Theodore. 66 million. That's right, 66 million years ago. Very bad day. According to Forbes magazine, what star of the live-action Barbie movie was the highest-paid actress of 2022? Jack. Margot Robbie. Margot Robbie is correct. What former Georgia state representative and two-time gubernatorial candidate is the author of the best-selling thrillers While Justice Sleeps and Rogue Justice? Gabriella. Stacey Abrams. Correct. In 1973, less than a year before Nixon's resignation, what vice president resigned amid charges of federal income tax evasion? Finley. Spiro Agnew. Yes, Spiro Agnew. The Pan American Highway would connect North, Central, and South America were it not for the Darien Gap, a remote, roadless area of more than 60 miles on the border of Panama and what country to the east? Lachlan. Colombia. Correct. What prominent actor from Boston was once a rapper with the stage name Marky Mark? Danny. Mark Wahlberg. Correct. In 1962, what French president signed an agreement recognizing the independence of Algeria after 132 years of French rule? Gabriella. Uh, de Gaulle. Charles de Gaulle is correct. That is the end of the toss-up round. The score is BC High, 110 points. Weston has 180 points. Let's hear it for both of our teams. The head-to-head -head round is next, but first, we're gonna take a few minutes to get to know our players, and as always, we do that with a question. BC High, we're gonna start with you. If you had to wear a T-shirt for the rest of your life with one word on it, what would it be and why? Danny, what's your word? Well, since I'm going first, I'll set the bar high. I'm gonna go BC High hyphenated. 
I just really want people to know where I'm from, have some eagle pride. A technicality, we'll check with the English department to see if it qualifies. All right, Lucas? Uh, I'm just gonna go with Boston, because it represents the area I'm from, where I go to school, and my love for cities and geography. I'm pretty sure you can buy that within like yeah. 500 feet of the door <laughs> here too. Theodore? I would say explore, because I think traveling and just getting to know the world around you is something that everyone should do, and it's something that I hope to do a lot more when I get older. Inspirational, I like that. Jack? Uh, I'm gonna have to say Jack, just to save time on introductions. <laughs> and it'll help you too, just in case you forget, so that's good. Finley? Uh, I think I'm gonna go with bookworm, because I'm a big reader, and to sort of act as like an attractor for people that I might want to associate with, you know? It's easier to make friends when you have something like that. People are like, what are you calling me? And then, oh, and then they wanna be friends with you, I like that. Lachlan? Uh, I would just go with Lachlan, because that way people would know how to spell my name. You had that problem a lot? Yeah. Gabriella? Um, I think I'd go with unrestrained because it's kind of the way I think. I like to be outside. I like to explore a lot of different things, so it kind of works for me. That can be like a whole fashion brand. <laughs> go with that. Ben? I would say chocolate because I'm really hungry right now. <laughs> we'll take care of that, but you get a few more minutes. All right, teams, it's time to go head to head. In this round, correct answers add 10 points to the team total, and wrong answers result in a 10-point deduction. The clock is set at 90 seconds. Get a little handshake here. All right, let's have a great round. Here we go. By a wide margin, what country has the world's largest Spanish-speaking population? Mexico. Yes. Foreign boon water is added to wheat flour. What protein makes bread dough elastic and stretchy? Alcohol. No gluten. Our sun is one of over 100 billion stars in what galaxy? Milky Way. Yes. Seeking a western route to the Spice Islands, what Portuguese explorer? Columbus. No Magellan. Name the process by which green plants transform... Photosynthesis. Yes. In Great Britain, what upper house of parliament is also known as the House of Peers? The House of Lords. Yes. A heptagon is a polygon with how many sides? Seven. Yes. Before France took control in the 1800s, Vietnam spent more than a thousand years under the imperial rule of what country? France. No, China. What is the largest library in the United States? The Library of Congress. The Norse god Odin rules over what majestic hall for slain warriors? Uh, Valhalla. Yes. In 2023, Democrat Donna Deegan became the first female mayor of what city that has the largest population in Florida? Miami. No, Jacksonville. At 70 years old, who was the oldest person to sign the Declaration of Independence? Ben Franklin. Yes. In 2012, the U.S. Anti-Doping Agency stripped what American cyclist of his seven consecutive Tour de France titles? Lance Armstrong. What was the 50th state to join the Union? Ooh, did they get in? Do you see that? Hawaii. That is correct. All right, that's the end of the round. Let's take a look at the score. BC High has 110 points. Weston High has 220 points. Still a lot of game to play. Let's have a round of applause for both teams. Up next, the category round with the following categories. Hammer time. Better call Paul. Tiger beat. Crazy eights. Pyramid scheme. And clothes minded. All categories have five questions with increasing point value. Teams will choose two five-question categories each and have the option to toss one question per category to the other team that the other team must answer. Players are able to confer. Now, BC High, who's your spokesperson? Lucas? And Weston, your spokesperson? Finley. All right, BC High, you've got some ground to make up. You're going to choose the first category. Uh, we'll take Pyramid Scheme. Pyramid Scheme. In this category, all the questions are about ancient Egypt. For 10 points, the Great Pyramid of Giza is constructed chiefly from what white sedimentary rock? Or limestone? Sandstone or limestone? I think limestone. 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 Limestone is correct. For 15 points, in an ancient tale, the god Osiris ruled Egypt until he was killed and cut into pieces by his jealous brother Set. What goddess reassembled her husband's body and brought him back to life? That's Isis, right? I don't know. Isis? That is correct. For 20 points, 
Cleopatra was the only pharaoh of her dynasty to speak the Egyptian language and make any effort to know the Egyptian people. She was part of what Greek dynasty that ruled Egypt? The Ptolemy. The Ptolemy. Ptolemy. I think it's Ptolemy. I'll take that. Ptolemy. That is correct. For 25 points in pyramid scheme, what new kingdom queen declared herself pharaoh and ruled for over 20 years, wearing a false beard as a sign of authority because Egyptians thought of their rulers as male? We'll pass this one. That is Hatshepsut. And for 30 points, originally an Egyptian hieroglyph used to represent the word life, what symbol, a cross with a loop above the bar, was often carried by Egyptians as an amulet or good luck charm? I'll pass this one. That is the Ankh, A-N-K-H. Weston, your first category. What do you think? Anyone have any strong? No, I don't care. We'll take Better Call Paul. Better Call Paul, these are questions about famous Pauls. For 10 points. On June 8th, 2022, at Boston's Fenway Park, what rock legend gave a concert that opened with Can't Buy Me Love? Paul McCartney. Paul McCartney? Correct. For 15 points, Ant-Man and the Wasp is the first Marvel film to have a female superhero in its title. Evangeline Lilly plays the Wasp, and who plays Ant-Man? Paul Rudd. Paul Rudd? Correct. For 20 points, what German military commander became president of the Weimar Republic in 1925 and died in 1934, shortly after naming Adolf Hitler the German Chancellor? Paul von Hindenburg. Correct. For 25 points in Better Call Paul, along with Kevin Garnett and Ray Allen, who was part of the big three that led the Boston Celtics to an NBA championship in 2008? Paul Pierce. Paul Pierce. Correct. And for 30 points, famous for his signature handshake, which signifies an impressive bake, what celebrity chef and cookbook author is a judge on the Great British Baking Show? I think they wrote something down. I think they might know it. I'm going to say we pass. 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 We're looking for Paul Hollywood. BC High, your next category. Crazy Eights. Uh, we'll take Crazy Eights, please. Crazy Eights. All answers in this category are eight letter words. For 10 points, Several U.S. states have permanently banned what controversial drilling technique, also known as hydraulic fracturing? Uh, fracking. Correct. For 15 points, in optics, what term refers to the range of different colors produced when visible light passes through a prism? Spectrum. Yes. For 20 points, what dark fantasy novel by Neil Gaiman is about a girl who finds a secret door that leads to a seemingly idealized version of her own family? Coraline. What? Coraline, maybe. Coraline? Maybe, I don't know. Okay. Coraline? That is correct. Nice job, dude. For 25 points, actor Alfonso Ribeiro created the Carlton dance for the show The Fresh Prince of Bel Air. In 2018, he tried to sue the makers of what video game for allegedly stealing his dance moves? Fortnite. That is correct. For 30 points, whenever we go abroad, people refer to us as Switzerland. The king of Swaziland said this in 2018 in explaining why he changed his country's name to what? Eswatini. Correct. Weston, final category to you. Do you think hammer time? Yeah. Okay. Hammer time? Hammer time. In this category, all the questions are about simple machines. For 10 points, what type of simple machine uses wheels and a rope to raise, lower, or move a load? Pulley. Pulley? That's correct. For 15 points, which of the following is an example of a wheel and axle? A jar lid, a doorknob, or ramp? Doorknob. Doorknob. Doorknob? Correct. For 20 points in hammer time, a seesaw is an example of what type of simple machine defined as any rigid bar that pivots on a fixed point? Lever. Lever, yeah. Lever? Correct. For 25 points, what Latin word for bedpost refers to the pivot point of a lever? Fulcrum. Fulcrum? Correct. And for 30 points, what ancient Greek mathematician is said to have invented a machine called a screw? for removing water from the hold of a large ship. Oh yeah, Archimedes. Archimedes. 
That is correct. That is the end of the category round. The score is BC High 255 points and Weston has 390 points. Let's hear it for both teams. Okay, we are heading into the final round of play, the lightning round. Correct answers add 20 points to the team total and there is a 20 point deduction for incorrect answers. The clock is set. Here we go. In 2023, a dog named Buddy Holly won best in show at what annual dog competition in New York? Jack. Westminster. Correct, Westminster. What Shakespeare character is exiled from his hometown after killing a character named Tybalt? Gabriella. Romeo. Yes. Which of the seven countries of Central America is the only one with English as an official language? Lucas. Belize. Yes. What six letter word refers to delicate feathery clouds found at high altitudes? Lucas. Cumulus. No, Cirrus. The Sultan Ahmed Mosque, popularly known as the Blue Mosque, is located in what Turkish? Lucas. Istanbul. Yes. What bay located in the Mid-Atlantic region is the largest estuary in the United Finley? Chesapeake. The Chesapeake Bay, yes. Beginning about two and a half million years ago, hunter-gatherers lived in caves or simple dwellings during what period also known as the Old Stone Age? Finley. Paleolithic. Yes. What Tennessee city is named after the first capital of ancient Finley? Memphis. Yes. After hydrogen and helium, what is the third element? Lucas. Lithium. Yes. Dutch, French, and German are the three official languages. Finley. Luxembourg. No, Belgium. The base of a well-formed quartz crystal will typically have how many then? Six. Six is correct. The Volga River flows southward into what sea? Lachlan? Caspian. Yes. Who is the Greek goddess of agriculture, grain, Finley? Demeter. Yes. In the 1970s, what former boxing champion appointed himself president? Finley? Muhammad Ali. No, we were looking for Idi Amin. And the winning team this week is Weston with 490 points. BC High finishes with 315 points. Congratulations to both teams for a great game. Weston moves on to play Acton Boxborough in the quarterfinals. Join us next week for the match between Lexington High School and North Quincy High School. We'll see you right back here on High School Quiz Show. Major funding for High School Quiz Show is provided by Safety Insurance. Additional funding is provided by the Museum of Science, Massachusetts Teachers Association, Xfinity, UMass Amherst, Peabody Essex Museum, and Subaru of New England.